RIT is focused on student success. That's something that's been part of our tradition. But the RIT of today is much more than that. One of the distinctive features of RIT is its co-op program. So every undergraduate student uh, is required to earn the equivalent of a year of cooperative educational experience working full-time in industry at full-time wages. I've co-opted at three different companies, um, working in three totally different departments. My last co-op I just finished up uh, in the fall. I worked in San Antonio, Texas at Toyota's manufacturing plant down there. I did two co-ops, two six-month blocks. My second co-op was with Moog out in uh, East Aurora and worked in the space and defense where I was doing internal um, applications making for them for their IT department and it was a great experience. It's really cool to actually see what we do in class be applied to the real world and be able to learn exactly what goes on. Over 75 percent of the students that are graduating from the College of Engineering will get at least one job offer from one of their co-op employers. We have virtual 100% placement of our students for full-time employment within six months of graduation. My most recent co-op was with Schlumberger. Uh, it's an oil and gas services company in Houston, Texas. I was actually uh, driving back from Houston when I got the offer letter to come back. I co-opted with Anheuser-Busch over in Syracuse. I received a full-time job offer, so I'll be working for them in June. RIT has the distinction where the students um, have a, a real, real world perspective that it isn't just the technology to become expert at, but they're going to be working in businesses. They're going to have to have a work ethic. They're going to have to emphasize completing work the best they can within a schedule and within a budget. RIT graduates come in and don't have the usual one to two year learning curve that some of the other schools do for those aspects of their jobs. Corporate partnerships are a very important part of our heritage and part of our brand today. These same companies that hire our students as interns or co-ops or full-time employees are the companies that we're working with either directly or maybe through consor consortia uh, to fund our research activities. The collaboration between Freescale and RIT is a special one. Maybe only about three years ago, we opened up actually in the new facility here in the computer engineering department. We've been able to put you know, later, our latest technologies in the hands of students here. We also have started working with them in a robotics competition this past year, and uh, they're, they're very excited about it, very passionate about it. RIT is constantly trying to align their programs with what industry needs. For instance, the computer engineering department has set up the RESIST research group, which is completely devoted towards security technologies and developing security solutions for real world problems. And they're actually helping us develop innovative features for our products. We've had a fabulous uh, relationship with Helwood Packard, really an industry academic uh, role model for what we, what we do, uh, the research that we do. HP funds a portion of the lab to do research in uh, algorithms that are value add to their product lines. In the last 10 years, we've really made an explicit commitment to grow research. We really believe that by having faculty practicing what they teach, that it enhances the quality of the education that we can provide to our undergraduates. We want to be able to com compete with, you know, with the best universities out there. So our research is a game changer for RIT. Defining element for us today that uh, we're really proud of is the extent to which we've expanded the diversity of our student body and of our faculty. Well, I've seen women come a long way here at RIT. Uh, in, the, in the short period of time that I've been here as the Director of Women Engineering, by having a program like this, we can pull them together, we can create networking opportunities, build relationships, do some professional development that um, complements their academic experiences. So it really helps them have a strong sense of confidence in their abilities to do what they're doing. Well, RIT is really uh, moving forward at a fairly rapid pace now in our graduate program, not only to be competitive with other universities, but so that we can grow ourselves uh, to the identity that we are seeing a vision for for the future. One of the things that brought me to RIT was this sense of entrepreneurial spirit. Um, as big as RIT is, it still feels to me like a startup, where 
you're encouraged to take risks. And if you fail, we learn from failure. So we're constantly reinventing ourselves. We're constantly asking ourselves, how can we be better? What can we do to make ourselves better? And then we put it into action.